We don't want no rats. No rats. No snake. No snake. Parents of students attending Presal Secondary School took it upon themselves to vent their concerns through a demonstration, highlighting those and other concerns in classrooms at the school and saying that the environment is not conducive to learning. A parent, Mary McQuan Mohammed, states that the past problems began after the start of the new academic year in September. And there was visible signs of rodent droppings, bat droppings, snake droppings, um, small insects. Um, the furniture is in a deplorable condition. President of the Parent Teacher Association at the school, Chris Balkaran Singh, says the Kuva Tabakital Para Regional Corporation assisted by initially providing rat poison for the areas where the droppings were seen. However, at present, he tells us the bait has been placed about the entire school. Apart from the rat infestation, simultaneously with that, we had um, a classroom where the ceiling literally, part of the ceiling literally fell off and that class was closed off, right? Then we have approximately three classes where the ceiling is hanging, right? Coming loose and hanging. Um, we also have electrical outlets within classrooms that are exposed, no covering, nothing. He also states that there are mosquitoes at the school as water is collecting in certain areas. According to the PTA president, a few children have fallen ill suffering from similar symptoms, including fever, body pains, diarrhea and vomiting. He admits, however, that they have no confirmed cases of leptospirosis, but claims that a test has been recommended for a child who fell ill and suffers from leukemia. Balkaran Singh says the school was closed on Friday and will not reopen on Monday, but the PTA has not been given a reason for this. Many parents are reportedly keeping their children at home. The handful of students that were going out to school um, were basically um, not being given any such a word because classes were basically empty. Basically what we are asking for is quick and speedy but um, um, comprehensive um, assistance from either the Ministry of Education, the OSHA authority, or anybody of society that can deal with correcting the major issues that exist at this time. Alicia Boucher, TV6 News.